Please consider the following. Is it possible to make a boat out of concrete? Using Archimedes' rule, it is possible. To make a concrete boat float, the force of buoyancy must be equal to the force of gravity pushing it down. Buoyancy is found by f of b equals p of f times v of f times g, f of b being force, pf being density of liquid, vf being volume of liquid displaced, and g being gravity. The force of gravity is found by f equals m times a, f being force, m being mass, and a being, in this situation, gravity. Since these forces must be equal, we will set them equal to each other and get the mass of the boat times acceleration e equals P of F times V of F times G. Since A and G are equal, they cancel out and we are left with the mass of the boat equals PF times VF. The mass of the boat is the density of the boat times the volume. The density of water is a thousand kilograms over meters cubed and the density of concrete is 2,400 kilograms over meters cubed. So the volume of the water displaced must be 2.4 times the volume of the boat, which means 70% of the total volume of the boat must be hollow. In order to make the concrete boat, we began with the mold. We then made the concrete mix and poured it into the mold. However, on our first try, the mix wasn't right. You see this concrete? We messed up. Messed up bad. This is sand. <laughs> we made sand. On our second try, the concrete mixture was correct. Then there was another problem. It's not gonna work. What happened? So, uh, it broke first. Someone so was, we glued it. Someone was messing with it too much. But then, when we tried taking the taking the boat off, the glue glued it to the glue. Glue it fell apart again. <laughs> and it became very brittle after one crack occurred. Okay, it just started gonna, splitting gonna, across. I'm going yeah. to barely touch this. It's just, it, it, it's already cracked and everything, so that's this, why oh, Okay, that part did took a little bit more force. The dream is dead. Why? This time, instead of one large boat, we made two small boats with chicken wire inside of the concrete. Then we cut them out the mold and tested them. After spray painting them, we set them on fire and left them adrift in the lake where we then sank them. <laughs> 